Yo! What's up, Cubers? I hope you guys are all having an awesome Friday. You guys, you know, there's only 39 days till Halloween. So you know what I did? I want to start a little bit early. You know, I want to open up a special Halloween collection from Speed Cube Shop. So, all right, we're gonna open this up right now. Enjoy the video. All right, guys, let's open this up. We got our kitchen scissors right here. Let's move this or our spear on the side. Let's open this. Actually, we even need the scissors. Just pull the tab right here. It looks like we're good. Right, so in addition to in addition to the cubes, the Halloween cube that I got, I also bought a special cube that I wanted to try out too. So it's gonna be very special. Alright, so let's see what we got right here. Woo wee! Hey guys, it's the Halloween cube. I'll have a close up of the, the cube a little later in the video. So there's that. Woo wee! Alright, so everyone's been telling me about the GAN 12 Magma being like one of the best top cubes out there in the market. So I got that to try out, so we're gonna review that. Uh, let's see what we got here. Mega Minks. Uh, this is for my sister, so she can have one. All right, look at that, guys. A Halloween, one of the one of the themed ghost bag, one of the themed Halloween bags that Speed Cube Shop offers. I got this one's pretty cool. Put some cubes in there. Oh, you know what it is, guys? The Jack O' Lantern Lube. Oh my goodness, so so good. Look, I I I still have like a little bit left. See right here. But I need to get a new one. And they only come once a year, so yeah. And then we got the Martian Lube. Running a little low on that too. Last but not least, we got the Halloween Speed Cube Shop, shop mat. Look at that, guys. Pretty cool. So I'm gonna open these up right now. And all right. All right, guys. So I'm gonna start with the Halloween seasonal stuff first. So let's see what's new. So the first thing we got here, we got a, a Halloween uh, mini mat. Right here, and I have my computer right here to look up the price. Let's open this up first. Alright, look at that. So you guys, you guys can pick this up on Speed Cube Shop for $5.99. So it's a pretty good price. Look at that guys. So looks like there's a haunted haunted house with some bats, a witch, a full moon. It's got everything that's Halloween like just awesome. So I'm gonna leave that right there for you guys. Cool. All right, guys, next thing we got. We got the Scared Ghost Cube Bag. And you guys can pick this up on Speed Cube Shop for $2.99, so $3 basically. And look at that design, pretty cool, I must say. So we're gonna leave that there. Cool. All right, now, um, got the jack o lantern lube, guys. Let's open that one up. Same thing as last year, but this is always, oh my goodness. Like this is like the best lube, I would say. This is the one that I use the most. All right, all right, look at that, guys. Jack o' lantern lube. You get lube. You guys can pick that up on Speed Keep Shop. 15 milliliters of lube, and this is for 12.99. Look at that, guys. Ooh. The best part is when you open it up. Oh my goodness. Oh, it just smells like pumpkin spice, which is like the best. So it makes your cube smell good too. Just kind of weird but cool at the same time all right last halloween seasonal thing we've got right here the spooky cube which glows in the dark just like the one from last year so you can tell the design's a little bit different the colors are different too which is very nice you guys can pick this up on speed cube shop for 9.99 right now it'll probably go on sale maybe towards the end of halloween too, but Open this up and get some first takes on it. Alright, All right, so let's let's see how this feels guys. Alright guys, so here we have it right here. The new spooky cube. Look at that. Alright, so out of the box it feels just kind of weird. It's like almost like a sandy kind of material. Woo -wee! Super duper fast. That's like the same thing as the other one from last year. This is the one from last year. Ooh. 
super duper fast. Almost kind of uncontrollable, but you know, nothing like lube can help, right? So you guys, you get this, you can always add this into here, and it makes this cube way smoother, which is like really cool. Look at that. All right. A couple of chili turns. Yeah, so overall, very nice cube, very smooth, same size as the other one, and yeah. Oh, look at that. Oh yeah, and then after that, sometimes you have to, when you solve it, you have to fix the face too. Oh. Look at that. Plus, this thing glows in the dark, so let's go test that out. Look at that, guys. Pretty awesome. I mean, obviously it's like kind of fuzzy because of my phone quality, but that's awesome. Hi guys, so that's it for the Halloween spooky cube this year. And would I recommend it? I would say 100% yes. It's a good cube, it's really fast, it's smooth, buttery, you can almost say. And yeah, that's pretty much it for that. And to the next thing, guys, we've got the Martian move. And there's nothing, I mean, this is nothing special about it, but always an amazing move to be using. It's very controllable, fast, like it's like every single possible thing that you want in a speed cube to put in your speed cube because it just makes it so fast, so smooth. Something that I really like. Yeah, there it is right there. Cool. And next we have the um, 5x5, I'm mean, not the 5x5, the Mega Minx. And we've already done a review about, about a review about this. Comes out like a little bit dry, but with lube, and obviously you lubricate it and it makes it really smooth. That's awesome. And guys, to the moment we've been waiting for. Right here, guys. The GAN 12 Maglev UV coated, guys. This thing was really expensive on Speed Cube Shop. Don't check the price. But it cost almost. But it cost almost. Alright guys, so this is $50, $59 at Speed Cube Shop. So this is one of the most, this is probably the most expensive cube I've ever bought on, like ever, ever, I would say. Actually, except the 7x7, 7 7x7 7 7 was like $40, $40, but this, this is really expensive. Gan really makes their cubes expensive, so because they're really premium and they're really fast and smooth, and we're going to open this up right now, okay? Let's do this! Let's go! Alright guys, so here we have it. GAN 12 Maglev UV Coated Cube. And guys, remember this came out in 2021. It still stands as one of the best cubes to date. Which is really awesome and really amazing. And especially because GAN came out with the GAN 12. They came out with the GAN 12, they came out with the GAN 13. And recently the GAN 14, which is probably the worst cube out of their collection. So here's this one right here. And let's open, oh, that was so clean. Did you see that? That just came apart, ooh -wee. just like that. All right, so as you can tell, the box is really, really, really shiny. One of the, probably, this is probably the coolest box I've ever had, which, okay, let's open the cube. Open up the box to find the cube. Okay, so like always, they come with a, like a little card right here, which is cool. Let's put that aside, really eat that. Okay, there we have it, guys. Oh my goodness. Looks exactly like this cube, guys. So this is the GAN 11 Duo, I would say. Yeah, I think so. Something like that, yeah. And this one is like, this is cool. It's like fast, it's light. It's smooth. But would I say this is my main cube? I would say not. Main, my main cube right now currently is still the MoU RS 3M. 2021 and uh, sometimes the YS3 from Yu Sheng Du. All right, so got the cube station card right here, which is pretty cool, I guess. We need that. All right, let's open up the accessories box real quick. Sorry, I know this is always the boringest part about opening the cube, but you always have to go through this. So, like a standard GAN cube usually has, they have. Plus, we've got the Chinese instructions. Don't worry, there's English. 
uh, more instructions about the setup of the cube. And look at this, guys. This is like the, it's like, it's almost like Dan is making AirPods. But look, oh, look at that. I need to do it again, right? So close it. This is literally like an AirPod box. Boop. There we go. Dan's literally trying to copy Apple, guys. And look at all these little accessory things. I don't even know how to use them, but this is the main one, though. Supposedly, you're supposed to use this to customize the magnets and stuff inside, so we'll have to figure that out later, but that's just for you guys to see. So that's cool. All right, so look at this fancy box. Very nice. Open it up just like that by squeezing the sides. And there we have it, guys. Oh my goodness. There it is. Oh my goodness. Feels UV coated. Look at that. Oh my goodness. First couple of times. Oh my goodness. This is so smooth. Wow. It's really light, really fast. Wow. It's a, it's a really weird, feel, really weird feeling. And like, look at that, look at that. You rotate it, and it just automatically, whoop, whoop, look at that. And it's because of the magnets that are inside of the cube, which is really awesome. So let's open it up. So the, 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 the adjustment system is a little bit, well, that's really, look at all those numbers inside to figure out how to, how to use that, but that's that, so that's pretty cool. And then, if you open this up, see, I can't, I can't even open it because it keeps realigning itself. Oh, look at that, look at Oh my goodness, it just realigns. Oh, there you go, and it does, but then you move it a little bit. Oh, goodness. There's so many magnets in here, guys. Look at that. And like the piece, the pieces are connected. Like, so you see the corner, look at the, the corner stock right here. There's a magnet on the corner stock. Gan just thinks we need more magnets, guys, on the cubes. But look, it almost touches. No, it does touch. It touches the core right there, you see? You see how I want to connect it? And then that's how it moves. That's how it... It has like the little adjustment system. That's why the magnets keep on readjusting towards when you turn. When you turn, it goes like that. That's so awesome. Oh, now the magnets, it's stuck on the other magnet. That is really cool. The core looks like a plastic core, kind of standard. But the magnets though, that's something, that's something different, something cool that I've never seen before, except for right now. Look at that. Go. And guys, that's pretty much it. I guess we can do a couple of solves. Let's do a couple of solves and see how, how things go. All right. All right, so we got a random mix up right here. So let's see how this goes. So not bad. So I averaged an 11.7, so pretty good time. Yeah, but this cube is really crunchy, it's smooth. But I feel like it's a little bit a little bit too fast for me. Something I should probably work on. I gotta work on having a higher TPS. But yeah, honest, honestly, this is a really solid cube. Would I recommend it? I would say yes. Especially if you're looking for something really fast, something smooth. It's really crunchy, it has a really crunchy noise, which is also really satisfying. But yeah. All right, guys, awesome. All right, guys, so that concludes today's unboxing video. So to summarize, we opened up the Spooky Halloween Cube from Speed Cube Shop. It has a really cool new logo from last year's Ghost. All right, and then we opened up the ghost bag. We got that. We got uh, the Mega Minx, which my sister will open up later. And then we got this right here, the Halloween Speed Cube Shop Haunted Mansion Mini Mat. 
And last but not least, actually not true, we got the pumpkin and Martian loops. And last but not least, the Gantle Magic Cube, which I highly recommend for people who really like fast turning and want to take cubing to the next level. All right guys, thanks for watching this video. Let's go! Go cubing guys, and have a happy Halloween. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more videos. And we'll see you guys in the next video. Let's go!